And it's time now to announce our political man of the year. For services to Australian comedy, and in particular this late show news desk, the award goes, yes, to Victorian Premier Jeff Kennett. And he joins us now live from his Melbourne home. Good evening, Tommy. It's, um, it's, nice, to, it's nice to receive the, the, the award. It's uh, nice to receive the award. It's a cross between Ronald Reagan and Chuckles the Clown, really. You've, um, you've been Premier now for two months. Tell us, what, what's been the best side of the job? Apart from riding in the car with the flag on the bottom. Yeah, apart from that. That's a, that's a good bit. Mm, when you're yeah. Premier, apart, you apart get to that. ride in the car with the flag on the yeah. bottom. Yeah, apart from that, what's been that's the best? The <laughs> Which is your car, Mr Premier? Mm. Mine's the one with the flag on the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> We'll move over past the automobile thing. What uh, else has been good about the job? Well, it's been the ability mm -hmm. to implement radical new... Uh, now, now, for <laughs> radical on that... It's the ability to implement radical new policies. Yes, yeah, we got that. <laughs> Mr Kennett, in, in implementing some of those policies, some people have described you as a fascist, even, even a Nazi. Ah, uh, well, they used to say that about Hitler, didn't they? They did. <laughs> Mr... Mr. Kenneth, uh, thanks for your time. Bye bye. Yeah. <laughs> Please, unencourage him. And he gets worse.